Hello everyone, this is your instructor Asma Mushtaq from Double E Vibes and in this tutorial I will guide you how to create a project in C language on MP Lab. So the first step is similar that you learned in the previous tutorials. You will go to the project tab, slap project wizard, then click on next and here you are supposed to select the device for uh, the particular device for which you actually want to write the program in C. All right, once you are done with the selection of the device, click on next. Okay, so far you people had been using the assembly language programming. That's why you were using MP assembler tool suit. But now I will select an other tool that is actually microchip C18 tool suit. You will select this and from here you can get the different options. Uh, the first thing and the most important thing that you need to notice is here it should be selected MP assembler version 5.50 and in the browsing tab this must be the path that you have that you can actually see in this video all right then you will click on next and here you will actually browse the path where you want to create your first project so I will just write it as exercise one fine when i will name the project i will just click on the next next and then we will just finish then you will select the new file from here and here you will write your program that actually you want to write in c so hash include p18f4550.h in the assembly language programming you must have seen when you write or include the particular device then you write dot inc in case of the assembly language programming and while writing the code in the c you will have to write the pic microcontroller with dot h header file so that is the its particular head file, header file can be included okay then click on the next here you will be writing your main function I am basically writing a code for toggling the contents of a particular port B let's say all right and you know the more main body is always enclosed within the parentheses all right here I will declare the port B as the output port so I will write it as press B is equal to zero this will make my port B as an output port all right, then I will just write down the for loop for the infinite time so that it can uh, continue toggling the contents of port B. Here I will just say port B is equal to 0 cross 5 5 and then port B is equal to 0 cross A8. All right. So this was very simple program where I am just opening the contents of the code without any delay. Once we are done with writing the code, you will just save this file with the extension exercise.c. So the particular change that you need to notice is here you stored the file with the name c. Extension c. All right. Okay, the next step is to add the source file into the project let's just explore it exercise.c and in this way you can see your file or your source file has been added in this particular folder the next step that is different from the assembly language programming is you need to add the linker script so you will go and explore this linker script all you just have to do is to explore the folder where this is actually located uh, uh, you can easily find that linker file in the C drive and then look at program file 86 all right and then explore for microchip okay once you are done with the microchip then you can you are supposed to find or look at this particular folder MPS under suit and here you can find the linker once you have opened this 
linker file you will locate the linker file for 18f4550 all right so here you go in this way you will add this linker script file all right this step is very important that i'm going to explain uh, in the next uh, in next actually if you will try to build your project without these particular settings that i'm going to share then your project will have certain error while linking so for this you will go to the project tab and there you go for the build options and in the build options you can find or you will click on the project again and here one thing is important go to the directories and drop it down and you will have to locate the include search path all right when you will click on click on the include search path you can see there is no search path actually available so you will click on the new and then you will click on here you will follow the same steps like i shared go to the program files go to the c drive and in the c drive you will have to locate the folder program files and in the program files you will go to microchip here is the microchip and when you will open it you will uh, just have to locate the folder that is mp lab c18 if you have installed your compiler correctly then you can easily locate this folder and after that all you need to do is just add these folders so first of all you will add the h okay just enter it then again click on new follow the same steps as i have already opened it so now after adding the new i will add the library files fine then enter then again click on new explore the path and you need to add mp assembler okay and the last file that you are supposed to add is source that you can locate over here easily so in this way after adding these four directories you can just click on apply and okay let's now build this project and you can see it is built it successfully fine if you do not add those directories from the project tab and from the build options then you will have an error of linking once you are done with this you can easily debug your crowd while selecting the mp lab simulator and from the view you can go to the simulator logic analyzer and here you can actually test your ports fine so i will go to the channel i will just test the single pin so i will